Hello class, uh, this is story writing lesson three. And today our topic is problem, conflicts, and solutions. So a problem or a conflict is something that happens in a story uh, that can cause trouble or can solve. A solution is how that problem gets solved. All right, I'm going to start with a PowerPoint. Here we go. All right, so story elements. We're just going to start with some story elements. Uh, this is just a cover of a story called Fancy Nancy. Story should have three parts. A beginning, a middle, and an end. Story elements, the setting and characters are introduced at the beginning of the story, of a story. So when you start writing a story, you start talking about the the main characters, the setting, where and when the story took place, right? And those are things we've talked about so far. All right, so characters are people, animals, things, and all of you got to create your own, which is really great. Uh, the setting is when and where the story took place, like nighttime or in a garden. The plot and problem are in the middle of a story. So that's kind of what we're going to be talking about today. The plot is the events that happen in a story. And the problem is an obstacle faced by a character in the story. The solution is found in the end of a story. The solution is how the problem is solved. All right, so what we're going to do is you're going to go to this assignment here. And it says story, lesson three, problem solutions. Uh, so first of all, make sure you write your name. And here it says problem and solution. So problem is something that a character in the story wants to change, fix, or figure out. The solution is the way a problem is solved or fixed. Plot is kind of about all of it. All right, so what you're going to do, these are some problems, and you have to say which solution fits by, right, like by clicking on the letter. So Sarah missed the bus is letter A. My mom locked her keys in the car is letter B. My family was late getting to the movies is letter C. And Michael forgot his lunch at home, is letter D. So the first one, we had to wait for a later showing. When I think of a showing, I think of someone's watching something. So which problem fits with this solution? You tell me. He bought a lunch. So maybe there was something to do with lunch or eating. So look at the problems and write Click on or click on the right letter that fits with it. Third one is her mom had to drive her to school. So this is the solution. This is the way it was solved. What was the problem to begin with? You can look up here. She called my dad to bring her the extra set. So maybe someone lost something. All right, the next one, you need to solve this problem by writing a sentence about how you could solve it. Your pencil breaks. So what's something you could do to fix that situation if you have a broken pencil? I want you to think about it and write your best answer. Uh, solve this problem. You don't understand a math question. And I said useful sentences again. Um, so what could you do if you don't understand a math question? So you can write your answer here any way you like, um, as long as it's related, of course. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know. And the reason we're talking about this is next, next week, we're gonna be looking at um, a problem and a solution that we could have in our own story. Uh, we'll mainly be focusing on a problem, so something that happens. So something the character wants to change, fix, or figure out. And we're gonna read a story and talk about that next day so yeah. all right if you have any questions let me know and good luck